doing test-driven development from the development point of view. It takes the time because it depends on how, how many developers are familiar with the test develop, uh, driven development. Yes. None of them have not exposed to that test-driven development, then it's not the right approach to do it because it takes the time to do the training. So what about having trained? Yeah. Well, that's, that's what we've done parallel. Okay. So you, you, you train people as you go along. I think you're right. I think until you get the methodology and you understand the tools, you keep going with the normal traditional method, you bring people up to speed and then you transition. So that yeah. makes sense. Okay. Yeah. That's good. So now we can move into the um, 